A severe stress reaction to a shocking event may lead to a disturbance of the human mind. When such a disturbance is left to traumatize the psyche of the individual, he or she may fall victim to post-traumatic stress disorder. Modern sciences have greatly advanced treatment to this disorder. One such proposed advancement is 3MDR. It is originally developed for treatment on traumatized military personnel. With the aid of cutting-edge therapeutic intervention technology, the patient is supported by a psychiatrist and faced with extreme emotionally effective images. Each sequence starts out with a warming up on the treadmill. The psychiatrist then readies the patient with an introductionary talk about the traumatic experience, aimed to recollect the emotional state of mind that the patient associates with the time of his military deployment. To further motivate his immersion, the patient is then exposed to music that relates to his traumatic experience. The patient is then slowly exposed to a photograph that he also relates to his trauma. Each sequence confronts the patient with a unique image. These photographs are previously selected at home in preparation of the therapy. Once the photograph is shown full on screen, the patient is then asked to name several emotional associations that he actively experiences from the exposure. The operator of the Karen then inputs these in the computer and directly displays the words on the screen. Now confronted with the photograph and its direct emotional associations, the patient is then exposed to a desensitizing stimulus in the form of a small red ball that oscillates in front of the photograph. This stimulus eases the mind of the patient, allowing him to slowly reprocess the traumatic experience. Directly subsequent to the stimulus, the patient is asked to express his emotional state in a subjective score measured on a distress scale ranging from 1 to 10. After several identical sequences, the psychiatrist closes the session, telling the patient that he will be returning to present time. During this exercise, the patient is then exposed to positive stimulating music that empowers the patient with a sense of achievement. Finally, a subsequent evaluation is conducted between the patient and the psychiatrist about the whole experience.